Hi everybody, welcome back to Minecraft for the 3DS. So, uh, a couple episodes ago, it would be now, it was, yeah. Um, one of you guys commented, I will look up the name, and it just eludes me right now. Also, welcome to everybody that's new, I've gone up, <laughs> good golly, something like 13 subscribers in no time, in like 24 hours. So, uh, comment down below, say hello, let me know who you are, I look at all my comments, I'll probably reply, more than likely to reply. Okay, so let's have a look, let's have a look, uh, it was, good golly, City7, he's asked me to go on a surgery, that's uh, not surgery, on a journey to the border, and since we're not that far from the border, we may as well go and have a look, you know, which way, to see what happens when we go to, oh, that's the opposite of what I want, <laughs> I need that for the journey. Uh, so I said that I would once I've got some food, and I do have a little bit of food, and luckily we're not far from the border of the map. So, well, I think this is... Looks like it's a bigger map than we first thought. So it actually generates the next chunk over. Sort of. Not very f quickly. Ooh, vines. So we will uh, we'll, we'll just head out in this direction. Ooh, and the map t updates down the bottom. So I wonder how f um, It looks like I've poorly... Does this periodically generate? Like, does it just keep taking up more space in my 3DS? Uh-oh. There we go. So we're traveling north. We'll remember that. See, the, I know there's blocks there, but they're just not rendering. So this is not very quick at doing this, for obvious reasons, that it... um. It's playing on a 3DS, but how big is the world? So that's not just my map big. How many maps big is it? I have no idea. This is why we uh, go and explore, eh? It appears. So, what I actually looked up, I actually had a look at um, on the Mojang website to see what was up, what was going on. So, there, they have planned... Oh, this direction I turn this way. They have planned for local co-op, local multiplayer, which is awesome, if you ask me, because that means I'll, we'll be able to have other people. Well, it's a plant. I wonder how, how much of a struggle my DS is actually having here. That's interesting. Um, so that means we'll be able to have people join me in planes if they have the game. Which is cool. Um, I'm not really a fan of generating chunks like this. I'm not sure if there, there are chunks on this version. I'm not sure how the. Um, doesn't look like I can break them before they spawn either, before they appear on the screen. Now, yeah, question is is this going to work better on the way back? Because those chunks are already generated? Or does they despawn after all? while. It's interesting. It's interesting how it's handling this. Um, hmm. So we're going, I'm also heading in the wrong direction. Poor decision, eh? Because we're at, what, X1700? And negative Z. Alright, I'm... What's going on here? I just can't go up? Well, I can. The tree just didn't generate properly. Well, I might uh, head back and uh, for a little bit. I don't know how far away the place is. How many maps actually generate? Like, is this it? 
No? No? You're still going? Still chugging along. Still chugging along. This is in... I never. I didn't actually plan it to be this long. Like I thought it'd be. Whoa. Is that the world border or is that just wonky terrain generation? Um, see, if I jump down, I better make sure I can get back up. Oh, that hurt. So I didn't bring all that much with me, just a little bit of food. Um, I should have brought some blocks, honestly. Oh, I thought I died then. Uh, we can still get up there. There is some odd terrain gen there. This is not how Minecraft is supposed to look like when it's generating chunks. But that's okay. Alright. Okay. Getting there, guys. Getting there. We have five. What type of tree is that? That's like five trees in one. Um. Or is that? Ah, oh, that's a sacred oak. Why? With the mushrooms and stuff. That's okay. Um. Hmm. Where are we going? Oh. You are a wonky pig. There's half your head missing. Alright, so we've we almost each reached the edge of this map. I don't actually know how big this is because when I set the world gen, I set it to map, like the high the largest size. So that's water. Doesn't look like water though on the map. That's not a lot of water. That's alright. The game's serious stro seriously struggling right now. This is a, a journey. What is that? What happened there? Did it place an impossible position, maybe? So this is how world gen works, if you were wondering. It's not very quick at all. Um, all right, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. Looks like we're almost at the edge of this map. Whoop, tap the microphone a lot. Sorry guys, if you noticed. Um, remember, we've got to head back, so we really don't want to be, ouch, going too far away. So we've learned some things. This version of Minecraft does not like generating chunks. And... Um, We still haven't reached the world border. Alright. Um, so I actually looked on the website. As I said, I'm going to bring it up. Put it up on the screen at this around this time. And uh, show you the things that are on the screen. Now, the problem is going to be getting back at night time. Stars just randomly appear. Is this the edge of the map? Is it? I don't know. Will I ever really know? I assume it's just going to turn me around when I get to the edge. Got to wait for it to load. Hopefully not die from a zombie attack or something. Now it's just loaded another another map it looks like. We'll auto saved in ten minutes. So I'm actually gonna head back. We um don't want to be stuck in too much of this darkness for too long. So we're just gonna run all the way home. We'll try to. Um, what's really odd is the way the map is doing its thing. Um, it's like, because I've already been here. 
It's like it's re... No, okay, so it's re-rendering chunks. Yeah. So, uh... I have to be careful, obviously, when we're... <laughs> when we're exploring like we are. Um... Because it's going to be a very long and tedious journey to head back. Come on. Well, all right. We've learned some things. We've learned how what the game, how how the game functions on the 3DS as opposed to how it normally functions in like. Uh, any other version of Minecraft does not play well with others. <laughs> does not play well with the 3DS. Very well, at least very well. Um, it's functional, if that's what you would call it. Um, well, these are quite the trees. Doug, it making some noise downstairs. I'm going to go. I'm going out this afternoon. I wasn't planning on recording today, but you guys just love this so much. And you know what? It's gaining traction. I'm gaining traction, and I don't mind ex whoop, experimenting with some uh, new Minecraft. So I thought I'd record for you guys, because, well, why not? Guys are pretty awesome so far. Um, I have one dislike, which is odd. No comment to explain that dislike, but that's fine. Some people just hate people for no reason. Especially people on the internet. Have you ever noticed how people just get angry at other people on the internet because they're on the internet? Ooh, pumpkins. Just got one. Got to get down slowly. Anyway, uh, comment what you'd like me to do next time. I do plan on journeying the whole way to um, to the edge of the map. Um, eventually. Just uh, maybe not this episode. Uh, we started. Don't know how many maps big this Minecraft version is. Um, also, what's odd is I've seen no zombies. That's a lot of waiting, it appears. For uh, chunks to load, like this one. Maybe I'll get myself back on track by heading a little bit further this way. Cows? I hear a skeleton. Where? Who knows? Alright, so this seems to be getting itself worked out a little better. It's interesting to see that uh, I can generate chunks faster than the DS can load them. I can travel chunks faster than the DS can load them. I was not expecting that. I expected it to be more uh, playable than it actually is. So I guess we're really finding out how, how good this goes in the grand scheme of things. So this is going to be something we're going to have to deal with uh, regularly. Um, hopefully in newer updates this will get fixed. Because um, I don't see the DS being able to deal with multiple players doing this, by the way. This is, uh, like, multiple players are not going to be able to... going to be um, doing this any favours whatsoever. That's... Uh, it's going to be quite the struggle. Um, now we should be heading back home, I think, in this. Yeah, we, we live in this map. Uh, we are like this way ish. There we go. There's our base. So that was a nice uh, little bit of a journey for this episode. Um, Next episode I'll be finishing the house, or I will have finished the house. I'm not sure if I'm doing it on camera. I might actually time-lapse it just to speed up. I think that would be my best option. But, uh, yeah, anyway, um, I'll see you next time. We learned some things this episode, and I uh, hope you all enjoyed. Uh, Signing.